Nutella pizza is pretty good, I would say. But it's not Nutella. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Frame that moment, Dean Dublin. Frame that moment. Oh, Jesus. Oi. Eu sou a Má e hoje eu convidei alguns dos meus amigos gringos para provar uma coisa um pouco controversa, pelo menos para eles. Pizza doce. Aqui por esses lados a gente até encontra uma pizza de Nutella de vez em quando, mas não passa disso. Agora, o que será que os nossos amigos gringos acharam quando eles provaram esses sabores bem diferenciados das nossas pizzas doces brasileiras? Eu queria agradecer muitíssimo o pessoal da Pizzaria Paulista Dublin, que forneceu essas pizzas incríveis, deliciosas para os nossos amigos gringos provarem. Foi super legal ver a reação deles comendo pizza doce. Inclusive, tinha italiana aí no grupo julgando pizza doce. Então, vamos ver só o que a italiana, né? A origem da pizza achou. E para quem quiser conferir os outros sabores incríveis que a Paulista Dublin oferece e seguir eles no Instagram, quem sabe pedir umas pizzas bem gostosas aí em Dublin, eu vou deixar o link do Instagram deles aqui na descrição para você poder fazer o seu pedido. Agora, vamos conferir o que, que os nossos amigos gringos acharam da pizza Doce da Paulista Dublin. Welcome back! Hi! Hey guys, my name is Ross. You're all very welcome indeed. I'll be with the Dublin now for many, many years, and I'm here to check out some new food and uh, new experiences, courtesy of my good friend, Mal Maura. I'm Jana, and I'm from Germany. I'm Sofia from Italy. I'm Tara from Ireland, but I grew up in Bahrain. I'm from Dublin here in Ireland. Let's see what awaits us today. So remember that a few weeks ago you tried a Brazilian pizza? Yes. <laughs> In Brazil we don't stop at savory. We like making sweet pizza as well. Já olhou para alguém e pensou, o que passa na cabeça dela? No, God, please, no, no! So he was like, I don't want to find out what my pizza is like. <laughs> oh, by that point, like it's just it's children's game. <laughs> Today you're gonna try two different flavors. Okay, can you please try to read for me? Okay, pizza doce, banana, canela e leche condensado e prestigio. Oh, pizza doce, banana, canela e leche condensado e prestigio. Pizza doce, dulce banana, canela, e latte condensado e prestigio. Pizza doce, banana, canela, e leche condensado e prestigio. Okay, so any idea what's going that, on? I've, I have a fair idea what's going on in terms of I know the names of some of the foods, but I, what they're going to do together, doce, is the, the very, very beautiful, sweet material that we know. Fantastic pizza, we know. Banana. That's universal. Lech condensado. Well, not very surprised it took this long for condensed milk to rear its head again. Canela, no idea. Prestigio, no idea. It reminds me of the word in English of prestige, when something is of great importance, very prestigious. Prestige. That's, that's exactly what it means in Portuguese. Really? Yes. So, sweet pizza with banana. Canela. Canela is like cinema. Everyone, yeah. Cinema. Uh -huh. yeah. Milk. Condensado. Of course, we wouldn't stop at just changing savory pizza. We needed to give our twist to sweet pizza as well. I mean, why use Nutella when you have the whole world to explore? So today you're trying condensed milk with cinnamon and banana. And the second one you're trying is chocolate with coconut. I mean, sure look it, why not? Actually, that was something I was kind of thinking of now, looking at the crust. I was kind of thinking, don't think of it as a pizza crust, think about it as an apple tart crust. But at the same time, I'm lying to myself. Okay. You need to be true to yourself, guys. You do? In the modern world, you have to be really thought conscious and emotional and live in the present moment. Do you know what canela means? Cinnamon. Cinnamon, yeah, that's it. So, first you're gonna try banana, cinnamon, and condensed milk. Interesting. And I believe there's cheese. Why? That smells so f weird. Oh, there's cheese in it as well. Sorry, what? Mm. 
not everyone agrees with you here. I really like it. I would never, I would never have thought of this. Mm -mm. I would never make it up. Yeah. Mm. It is amazing. Right on. Yeah, the cheese okay. with the banana and the cinnamon. Yeah. yeah. The cheese. Nice. It works. Does it work? Yeah. It works yeah. so well. Yeah. And yeah. I, the consistency of banana put me off though a little bit. Because it's quite cooked. It's like squiddy. Not sure. Oh, okay. Oh, interesting. But I think it's a consistency thing. Yeah. Food wise. Mm. Mm. Fantastic. Mm. Right. If we could be in for it. A first time here on E Dublin, or I just say, no, no thanks. Really? Yeah. We got to that moment. You can't eat it. Oh. Wow, I'm mean, I'm impressed. I'm impressed too. It's the first time. First time in five years where I just went. It's like no cheese, bananas, condensed milk, and cinnamon. It's too much. Yeah. We got. We found what your limit is. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. So if you make more combinations of that, then you can frighten me more in the future. It'd be rude not to. At least try the other one. Yeah, it's different, it's completely yeah. different. I'll tell you, because you're used to Nutella pizza, the yeah. other one might not be as bad. So do you want to go ahead and try the prestige now? Yes. Yeah. Coconut and chocolate. So these pizzas were also made by our friends at Pizzeria Paulista. Mm -hmm. And they are available to order any time, any day of the week in Dublin. Frame that moment, D Dublin. Frame that moment. Jesus. Which type of like sweet pizza have you tried before? Mm, Nutella. Nutella. Yeah. Yeah, strawberries. Coconut. Coconut. Yeah. Ooh. We tried that. We tried that. We tried that. But the pigeon probably. Yeah. Oh, okay. Mm. Condensed milk and and coconut. Yeah. Coconut. Yeah. Nice. Mm, really nice. I think Nutella. Mm. Yeah. Not like Nutella and bananas. Yeah. Things like that. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. How do you guys eat this stuff? How do you do it? There's not a hope in hell. That I would finish this slice. It's like a cake mm. yeah. to me. They're like mm. cakes. Yeah. Mm. More than a pizza. Yeah. Well, I, I remember. Sure. You don't remember pizza, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> what about in Bahrain? I can't pronounce this. Bahrain. <laughs> Bahrain. Um, they do sweet like flatbreads, but yeah, again, like Nutella. Yeah. <sighs> okay, Polly is the pizza. Sorry, it was not today. No, sorry, guys. Stick to the savory one. Yeah. You're kind of your smoky calabresa hooking into my veins. But this, can't deal, Jesus Christ. Who sits down and says, I can't wait to sit down and eat a slice of this or this? Well, I won't even ask for a score. No. No. The chocolate one, a nine, and the banana one, an eight. Okay, I that's... really like it. That's like, I like it a lot more than I thought I would. Yep. Mm. Me? It's <laughs> <laughs> chocolate, 10. <laughs> and banana? 9.5. <laughs> okay. I really, I really like the mix. I can't see myself eating like a lot of it, but like I, I love the mix, like the chewiness of the cheese, but yeah. then like the sweet, the cinnamon. For me, I think it's double dropped. Like in, in a sense, like and um, taste-wise, I say it's probably a nine point five the banana, but because of the consistency, seven point five. The first time we see Ross said about food. Yeah, the little boy I had, to be quite honest, was tremendous. So tasty, but I, there's not a hope in hell that I would ever, ever have a slice, so the, a full slice to myself. The prestige one is better for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just the way it's, they're sweet, and then there's just overdose. Okay, but today is a day that people will always remember. Yeah, the day where I just said no. I love the taste. It's so it tastes so good. So I guess it's just getting used to it. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. it's like a kid. Yeah. The Nutella pizza, it's really good. Nutella? The Nutella pizza is really good, I would say. But it's not Nutella. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah. If you're going to like ask for pizza, have meat on it. Regular, usual things. Uh, yeah, growing up in Ireland, I never had any of this. It's like, if you're gonna have a pizza, just eat a pizza. If you're gonna have condensed milk and chocolate, put it in a bowl with ice cream. <laughs> It's probably a sort of brigadeiro or brigadeiro. just melted chocolate for the Melt end of the Yeah, I would say 8.5. If you want to see me come back, use the hashtag Volta Grindos, Volta Ross. Also, if you want to see all the other guys come back, make sure you include them down below as well. And Volta Tara. And Volta Yana, Volta Sofia. And follow me, Dublin. And also follow me on Instagram. Use your handle, talk to Ross, all one word. That's where I do lots of my uh, Irish history and culture, all that kind of good stuff. Not so much chocolate pizza, but a whole lot of talking about Ireland. Thanks a lot, guys. Bye. Ugh.